hello everybody i'm back with another video so i was on tiktok watching some videos and i <clears throat> noticed some interesting topics um that people were talking about so some people were like i'm indigenous and they're like i get confused for asian or some people will be like um what do you get confused for and so on or why do um indigenous people look asian and so on so i thought i answered that question because um like my family we all look asian um we always get confused for asian for some type of asian um asia is a big continent um look at the map to see how big it is and yeah so there's some theories that say that we came from asia 15 to 20 thousand years ago something like that and so on um so yeah we came from asia like if you didn't know indigenous people of the america from north america and south america came from asia we did not come from anywhere else um that's where we come from that's why we look asian um that's why we get confused for asian of course i'm not saying that uh indigenous people look asian I'm not saying that all indigenous people are supposed to look a certain way. But for my family, um, if you watch my videos for a long time, you know I come from a pure indigenous family, meaning that we didn't mix with the African slaves, the Africans, we didn't mix with the European invaders, we didn't, meet, we didn't mix with the European um, migrant immigrants, we didn't mix with the Asian immigrants and so on asian one when i mean asian immigrants i mean i mean like over the period of 500 years ago we didn't mix with them um we did mix with our own people which is indigenous people which came from asia so we mix with them we mix with our own kind um that's what i'm trying to say because um some people might say, oh, you look Asian because your family mixed with Asians from Asia. Um, so no, um, I've looked at DNA, my DNA, and we don't have a an Asian HAPA group. We don't have Asian HAPA groups. So my HAPA groups are indigenous to the Americas. So my HAPA group is QM3 and, and it's A2 and then so on. So... Um, if we were Asian, like we would have, of course I haven't looked at all our family hyper groups, but if, I'm pretty sure if um, we had some um, Asian from Asia within the fi within 5,500 years, we would have had like a male Asian hyper group from Japan, China and so on, um, Korea, um, but we don't. We have an indigenous. We have indigenous hopper groups, and of course, back then more men than female migrated. So again, there's no evidence of. Um, how do you say? There's no evidence of a an Asian hopper group in my family. So. Um, that's how I know that we didn't mix with Asians and that's how we know we didn't mix with Europeans um, My mom is mixed so she does have a European hyper group um, So her hyper group is a2 her maternal hyper group is a2 which is native indigenous um, To the Americas and then she has a European hyper group on her paternal side so she's mixed and she has a um, European hyper group so of course that's obvious um, because they mix and she her family her family looks mixed she's mixed um, so of course she's gonna have a um, a European hyper group um, but since my dad's side is not mixed um, they don't have any type of other hyper group except uh, indigenous to the Americas so that's how I know that's one of the reasons I know we are not mixed with 
any other race we mix with our own people um and yeah i wanted to share some pictures of my family no, i don't have a lot of pictures i was going through facebook and i found a couple but i didn't i was looking at them but i didn't save them but um you know i was on tiktok and i saw uh, a video of my cousin that looked like someone from siberia i was like hmm, this 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 girl who says she's Russian looks I mean this girl who is Russian and is saying she's Russian looks is Siberian uh, looks similar to my cousin um, so this is my well this is not my cousin this is my first cousin was removed you could say my niece if you if it's how do you say it? you could say you could just say my niece um, and to make it more clear she is my cousin's daughter on my dad's side so I have the video on my phone but I'm gonna play it so my cousin does TikToks my I mean my niece does TikToks and here's a video of my niece um, I don't know if you could tell but she looks a little bit Asian um, if you could see the video I think it's 10 seconds let me see one two Okay, so um, that's my cousin. Um, she looks brown, straight black hair. Um, she looks Asian, but she's indigenous. Her family, I believe, I think, I believe her family is pure indigenous. She, her family didn't mix um, with outsiders. Um, both of her parents come from the same town, so. Um, I haven't taken a she hasn't taken a DNA test but I believe she's pure indigenous but I don't know until she takes a DNA test but she does come from the same town from the indi same indigenous town so um, I doubt that her family mixed with other people and then here's a picture of my my nephew which is my first cousin wants to remove and this is my um, other cousin's son so we went to the pyramid and as you can see he has black hair dark brown and I don't know if he looks Asian like and I don't know what type of Asian he would look like but as you can tell he looks he looks different than my cousin but he looks to me he looks very indigenous um, but I don't know if you, like you would confuse him for a nation um, so I don't know and you can see we come in different colors and we look different and I have another picture with my little with my this is actually this is my actual cousin so this is me and my cousin um, so I don't know what like race he would look like or like ethnic group we come from we come from Mexico, a state called Veracruz, um, and yeah, we are from Veracruz, Mexico. We are indigenous to Veracruz. We are indigenous to Mexico, to North America, and yeah. So I'm just stating that because you know that's where we're from. And that's how people from there look like. I don't know how, I mean, I'm not gonna say, I'm not talking, when I make my video, I'm not talking about the whole people of the Americas. Because we all look different, we all have different climates, we all do different things for a living, we all survive different, um, and so on. So that's how the people of Veracruz, Mexico, at least where we're from, look like but yeah like people confuse us for Asian all the time um, I've gotten Filipino I've gotten Indian from India um, and then some people on my other video commented some other um, countries um, from Asia but I don't know that's their opinion that's their assumption um, like I said I'm not gonna make assumptions about um, what my family 
closely looks like like I'm gonna say oh I look more more Indian from India than this and that no yeah I mean any everyone can make their own assumptions um but yeah if you're more interesting about if you're more interested about learning about the history of indigenous people um and and how they migrated from Asia um there's many websites out there like you could read on 23andme has like a lot of information on this ancestry.com has a lot of information on this okay so i wanted to share a video but i mean a photo a screenshot of a website but i don't know if like it's copyright or something like that you know i i don't know so i'd rather just not share it but i will leave a link in the description i doubt you could i I think you could read it but i will leave some links in the description because i don't want this video to be copyrighted real quick so they say we came from asia like from siberia and alaska so we migrated from there all the way down and then we spread this um okay so i was reading this article i think i could talk about it so i was reading about this article it says you you share a paternal lineage with the ancient one a nine thousand year old old man from the pacific northwest so this they talk about how this person was found in washington and so on and i share a a hyper group with them um that they had the hyper group qm3 so I have the HEPA group and they came from Washington and I share a paternal lineage with them. So I think that's pretty cool. Um, imagine like we came all the way from Washington and now we're like uh, in Veracruz, Mexico. So um, that just shows um, part of part that just shows um, gives an example of how we migrated. So there's many theories as to how we got here to the americas so that could be another video that i could talk about in the future um, because a lot of people believe a lot of things so yeah i'll make another video maybe in the future